Hello everybody, welcome back to another convenience store food haul. Today we are going to be trying out some strawberry desserts from Family Mart. Now I am excited, it is strawberry season here in Japan. Yes, strawberry season is winter. Yes, the most demanding season is Christmas. Yes it is. Last year we went to a strawberry farm to pick strawberries. Yes we did, yes we did, that was so much fun. We have a video, if you missed it, check it out! We both love strawberries and strawberries in Japan are pretty sweet so we think we're gonna like everything we try today but anyway, instead of talking, let's try them out. Now the first thing we have here is called Ichigo no Parfait. Ichigo no Parfait, yeah. Translates to Strawberry Parfait. This is 350 yen, that's not including tax and it looks really wonderful. I love the container that it comes in. It's a pretty fancy container. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. In fact, I think you know we can just wash this later on and use it yes, for something. You know what I mean? I mean, you can buy this, you know, at the store. I mean, they actually sell these, you know, at those container stores, you know, and they're not really cheap. So there are some pistachios on the top. I see whipped cream, strawberries, and uh, that's jerry. Mm -hmm. Um, I think that's strawberry jam? Sauce, sauce, maybe. But anyway, let's try it out. Okay. Oh, it's very soft. Ooh. Very, very soft. Oh, it's Ooh. it's softer than I imagined it would be. Yeah. What's inside? Mmm. Oh, strawberry cream inside. It is mousse. Oh, it's like a strawberry it's mousse. mousse. It's really soft, like really mm. soft. Mm. How is it? Very creamy. Very creamy. Mm. And immediately it disappeared from my mouth. I know, I know. Um, mm. It's like a melting. Try the bottom. The bottom is mm. a little bit more firm. Mm -hmm. um, yes, it is. It's like a, uh, like a panna cotta. Like panna cotta. Yeah, yeah. It's really nice. Um, at first I thought there was nothing to it because it was just all soft. Mm. So at first I was a little bit disappointed to be honest with you because I don't really like completely soft desserts, you know. I need different textures. And with that panna cotta, I'm sure this is not panna cotta, I'm not really sure what this is, but this gelatin-like layer plus the very airy layer of mousse with the whipped cream on the mm. top, yeah, it's mm -hmm. a good combination. Mm -hmm. Three type of uh, texture. Yes, and actually four strawberry. because there are the fresh strawberries. Mmm. Oh, mm. Mm. you gotta eat it with the fresh strawberries. Mm -hmm. That really makes it dessert. Mmm. Mm. Love, love, love. <laughs> love, 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 love. The next one is Ichigo Sando. It's a strawberry sandwich. Mmm. It's 350 yen. That's not including tax. And you know, fruit sandwiches like this are very typical sandwiches here in Japan. We eat it all year long. In fact, we have a recipe that we did uh, last summer. So if you missed that one, check that one out by clicking on that I. It is one of my favorite types of sandwiches here in Japan. So okay. here you go. Thank you. And of course, because it's strawberry season, you know, there is a strawberry sandwich. Yes. Um, this is one thing that you don't see all year round, the strawberry. They have, you know, different uh, fruits that they use, you know, uh. when it's not strawberry season. Mm -hmm. So if you're in Japan visiting during strawberry season, give this a try. Yes. Hi. So other season are like um, kiwi or melon. Kiwi, melon. They have like peaches. Peaches. They have yes. fruit cocktail. Yeah. Okay. Hi. Thank you. Mmm. Really nice flavor. Mmm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Basically, I don't like fruit sandwich. <laughs> true. That is true. Why? Why don't you like fruit sandwiches? I think it doesn't do much with the the bread. The bread. The bread. <laughs> you know, a lot of people think that. I used to feel the same way. I thought fruit and whipped cream in mm. bread, mm. but I actually like it now. <laughs> yeah. It, it, at first, mm. I thought it was really weird. I I, I know I know where you're coming mm. from though. Mm. I, I I understand. I like sponge cake better. Yes. <laughs> um, if this bread is more sweeter, mm -hmm. uh, I I like this. Mmm. A little bit salty. A little bit salty. True. 
But I think that saltiness gives it a little balance, though. You know, like um, salted caramel. Hmm. Mm. I like this one. I think Family Mart does a pretty good fruit sandwich. Mm -hmm. The next one we have is Ichigo no Crepe, which Ooh. translates to strawberry crepe. Strawberry crepe. Ichigo no Crepe from Family Mart. Huh? Yes. And it's wow. 269 yen. Mm, and it is inside the bottle. Yes, it's inside a cup. Bottled crepe. A, a cup, actually. A cup. Yes. And um, I, I think this, this packaging is really neat. And when you take it out of the package, mm. the container, um, it's, it's like this. It, it, it's an actual crepe. Mm. And it comes with this wrapper so you don't get your hands dirty and um, you can hold the crepes with you know dirty hands preferably clean hands but uh yeah um here i'll let you have a bite of this first i see a lot of whipped cream in here oh, no. there is a whole strawberry cut in half mm -hmm. on the top oh whole strawberry yes oh. i'm hoping that there are more strawberries inside the crate <laughs> not just That's on the top hi mmm so airy whipped cream Really? Mm, airy? Airy. Is, mm. it, is it good taste? Whipped cream is good. Tastes taste good. And uh, the, the crepe wrapper is really soft. Oh, wow. Amazingly soft. Amazingly soft? Mm. Okay. Same texture as whipped cream. Really? <laughs> so there's absolutely no bite to it? No bite to it. Really? <laughs> is that good or bad? It's in good way. Really? Yeah. Alright. Very soft. Mm. Oh, I see what. Oh, I see what you mean. Wow. Okay, this one, I actually expected very little out of it. It didn't look that great to me, and I, I thought it was I wasn't going to enjoy this. But I like this one the best so far. <laughs> this crepe has a really nice flavor. What is it? But I need more strawberries. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> this. Th this crepe flavor. What is this? It kind of reminds oh, me of bottom of this crepe. There is a, a sauce, strawberry sauce. Really? Oh, mm. oh, give me some of that, please. Strawberry sauce. Mmm. This flavor and texture of the crepe. It kind of reminds me of like the flavor of dorayaki. It doesn't taste like ah. crepe to me. Here, try it ah. again. Like, like if you close your eyes and you don't think about the texture too much and just consider the flavor, mm -hmm. the flavor reminds me of dorayaki batter. Mm, yes. This is delicious. Yes, yes. Mm, mm. The next one is Ichigo no Ekurea, Strawberry Ekurea. Mm. 221, 221 yen. yen. Yes. Without tax? Without tax, yeah. And this one um, says um, there's fresh strawberries, and has a double cream, um, which wow. means they use custard, custard as well whip. as whipped cream. Wow! Yeah. Okay, let's open it up. Wow! Ooh, wow! I like how it's presented. Ooh! You know, and at first I thought that because you see the two shells of the eclair, one on top of the other. So at first I thought you had to um, place that bottom portion on top but that's not true because there is um there is custard yes. inside so if i did that i'll be getting custard on the outside so i guess you would eat it this way i mean Maybe. is this how you would eat this eclair Maybe. so this is like an <laughs> open-faced eclair i think so all right can i take a bite first yes please itadakimasu mm. it's a oh mm. this one is nice because there are whole, two whole strawberries mm. in this one. Mm. So you get mm. a lot of strawberry mm. flavor in each bite. Mm. Not just cream like the other one. Mm. Two types of cream gives a very good harmony. Yes, mm. yes it does. And um, there's vanilla flavor. Mm. Yes, I'm looking at the ingredients now because I tasted mm. some vanilla buttery flavor. Mm. Mm. And um, it says v there there is no butter in here, so. Very fruity cream taste. Really? Mm. Fruity What's cream? Inside? Vanilla beans. Vanilla beans? <laughs> Just vanilla beans? Just vanilla beans. Really? Yeah, no fruit in the cream whatsoever. Mm. Yeah. Wow. Now, okay. the, now the, my, my only complaint with this, I think, would be the soggy shell. 
you know, the eclair is very soft. It's more like a, like a, I don't know, like a cake, like a, not really a sponge cake. It, it's, it's really, I mean, let's just say what it is. It's just a soggy uh, eclair shell. But the flavor is good, the taste is good. For me, it's the shell that's just something, leaves something to be desired. Okay, I saved this one for last. This is called Ichigo Anmitsu. Ichigo Anmitsu. Yes. Ichigo Anmitsu. Yeah, 276 yen. Mm. And uh, Ichigo Anmitsu is a very traditional, typical Japanese sweets. And um, a lot of foreigners don't care for it because of the anko inside. The anko is a sweet bean paste. And I don't know, um, let me know if you guys are a fan of anko. I, I know some of you are. But this one definitely has anko in it. Right there, immediately you see that ball of anko. This is a uh, tsubuan. This is the smashed bean, not the smooth one. And um, let's dig right into it. And I oh. see something in here. What is that? Kanten? Kanten. It's kanten. Oh. So it's the gelatin. Kanten. Mm. But it's a brown kanten. Um, I don't know what it is, so, so it is I'm just going to take a bite. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Mmm. Ah, mm. I see. Nice flavor. Mmm. Mm, mm. I, I do have to say, it does not taste like your traditional amitsu. Mm. Totally different. Right? Because there's so much whipped cream in here. Mm. Um, usually, the main uh, flavor is whipped cream. Yes, yes. Let me try that. Kanten again. Kanten is Japanese gelatin made of agar agar. Kanten is um, kanten has a very subtle taste, but it has the mm. like molasses taste. It does. Mm. This one does. Okay, let me try some of the anko anko lovers. Anko <laughs> anko lovers, for all you anko lovers out there. I know it sounds like we're saying. <laughs> Uncle lover, you know, like you like your uncle <laughs> or you like older guys, but uh, no, when we say that, we're talking about the sweetened bean paste. Mm. You have to eat it with the uncle. Oh, really? Yeah. Without the uncle, it doesn't taste like amitsu, it just tastes like a strawberry whipped right. cream dessert. Right, right. right. With the uncle, it finally tastes like amitsu. Hmm. Okay. So which one was your favorite today, Satoshi? Mm, 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 mm. 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 This is a tough one. Mm. The first one, strawberry parfait. Oh, I see. I like the soft texture, the like cream texture. You do? Yes. Really? Wow, you don't like to bite food. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the smooth, uh, melting, disappearing flavor is yes. <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> Well, my favorite. This one is hard for me. Do you know why? Maybe because you know, it's all strawberries. And most of fruits uses a uh, whipped cream. Whipped cream. They taste pretty much the same. Mm. Like th they're all from the same family, obviously. But they just taste the same, just with you know slightly different variations. Um, I have to say, my favorite one is the last one. It's the Ichigo Amitsu, just because. The anko gives it an extra dimension of flavor, mm -hmm. and the kanten has that sweet molasses flavor as well. Um, this is my favorite. This one is the most multi-dimensional in regards right. to taste. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. so I choose the last one. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Which one was your favorite? Let us know in the comments down below. And if you miss any of our convenience store food hauls, make sure to check that out by clicking up up there. Check out our playlist. And if you have any suggestions or requests on what to do for our next convenience store food haul, let us know that as well in the comments down below. So thank you for watching and until next time, take care. Bye-bye.